Hello dear friends, today I want to show you how to monitor only the child user account on the computer with the KidLogger application for Windows. For example, on this computer there are several user accounts. One user account for me and two user accounts for my children. The first child and the second child. First, I want to show you how to monitor all three user accounts. First of all, I need to install the KidLogger application. But before this, I need to add two folders to the list of exceptions of the Windows security. The virus and threat protection and manage settings and exclusions and add and remove exclusions add an exclusion folder and downloads and one folder more program files x86 Now I can download the KidLogger application. The Google Chrome doesn't want to download it and I open menu, downloads and click Keep Dangerous File and click Keep Anyway. And now I install this application. and connect it to my personal account. You will insert here another email address. OK, start monitoring and close. Now I want to visit my personal dashboard on the kidlogger.net site. And I can see in my account appeared a new virtual device. If I want to monitor all users on this computer, I have to open the settings page and to check if the option lock all users on this PC is checked on. It must be checked on. I save the settings and log out my user account on this computer and log in my child user account. On the user account of my child I can reproduce some activity. For example, I can visit the YouTube And now I can log out and log in my second child user account on this computer.
On the second child user account, I will visit the Yahoo, for example. And now I log out and log in my personal user account. Now I want to visit my personal dashboard on the kidlogger.net site. And I can see in my dashboard appeared several new virtual devices. The first one is the device of my personal user on this computer. The second one is the virtual device of my first child. And the third is the virtual device of my second child. And if I don't want to monitor my personal user account on this computer, I just delete it. Delete the virtual device. And remain only virtual devices of my children. That's what I need to do to monitor only my children and not to monitor my personal user account. That's all. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.